Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Knives Monroe, and on this video, we're going to be discussing which is the best headlamp for you. We're duking it out between the UT27 NU43 and the HC65 UHE. Without any further ado, let's get into it, shall we? The Nightcore UT27 stands out as a bright, lightweight headlamp designed for running, with insights from professional trail runners. It features both white and warm light options. The white light spans an impressive 144 yards and yields an output of 500 lumens, ideal for outdoor pursuits like trail running, hiking, and nighttime strolls. The warm light extends up to 136 yards with the same 500 lumen output, making it excellent for penetrating challenging weather conditions like rain, snow, or fog. By combining both lights on turbo mode, 800 lumens of brightness emerges, casting a beam that reaches 175 yards. Now I wanna note that this is intended for long distance trail running. It has a very tailored use. Next is the Nightcore NU43 headlamp, bringing its power in a compact body. Just a little over four ounces in weight, the NU43 is capable of a 1400 lumen max with a max beam throw of over 142 yards. It's equipped with an upgraded unibody optical lens system, so you get a combination of its dual LED spotlight to see in the distance and a floodlight for close-up tasks and rating. I want to note its proximity sensor and its charging switch. This is a great all-around light for many uses. And finally, the Nightcore HC65 UHE rechargeable headlamp is the ideal companion for various activities such as working, camping, hiking, and more. Its ultra-high efficiency UHE LED system and optical matrix lens ensure optimal performance emitting a bright 2000 lumen beam that can reach distances up to 243 yards. It's ridiculously powerful. The HC65 UHE is the most powerful of the three, boasting its eight core UH LED, while the other two have standard LEDs. The HC65 UHE boasts a 2800 lumen turbo with a whopping 12,293 peak beam intensity candela. The NU43 peaks at 1400 lumen turbo with a 3400 candela. And of course, the UT27 clocks in at 800 lumen turbo mode with a 6,343 peak beam intensity candela. So what do these headlamps have in common? They each have USB-C charging, LED battery indicators, red light, adjustable rotation, lockout modes, APS-C tech, which is advanced power cutoff, which means very little parasitic drain. Leave it alone for a year and it still has charge. So where are they different? Where these headlamps differ are in their batteries. The UT27 is the most different from the three, in my humble opinion. It's lightweight and its batteries are meant to be swappable for convenience for long distance running. Charge multiple batteries the night before by a USB-C and they're good to go. The UT27 uses a Nightcore HLB 1300 rechargeable lithium ion battery pack with the option of using three AAA batteries. The more batteries, the longer you keep trail running, and that's the idea. The Nightcore NU43 is equipped with a built-in 3400 milliamp high efficiency battery for extended run times of up to 165 hours on ultra low and over 10 hours on high. You can't swap batteries out, but it can fully charge in under two hours via its hidden USB-C port. The HC65 UHE boasts a 4000 milliamp rechargeable battery. It can achieve a maximum runtime of 82 hours on its lowest setting. It also has an integrated waterproof USB-C port for easy charging, taking only two hours to reach full power. Next, where these headlamps differ is their size, weight, and shape. The UT27 is obviously the lightest at 2.61 ounces. Second is the NU43 at 4.09 ounces, and then the HC65 UHE at 5.36 ounces. Lastly, what sets these headlamps apart is the real-world use, the context. The UT27 is unequivocally designed for trail running, or the NU43 and the HC65 UHE could be best used for reading, work, camping, or hiking, but also trail running. 
For me personally, and this is just me, I want all the thinking taken out of a headlamp. I don't want to think. I want USB-C charging. I want the highest lumen that I can get and the smallest body at the lightest weight. I want a long runtime. The NU43 has the best charging port in my honest opinion. The switch, it's waterproof, it feels secure to me. The HC65 UHE comes in a storage case that I really respect. I'm bougie like that. So bonus points for that. The battery LED indicator is the best on the HC65 UHE, right next to the charger. That's nice. It makes the most sense for me and for my needs versus the NU43 where the LED is at the bottom. I just want to be able to glance at it while I'm charging at my work desk. And one of the things I want to highlight about the UT27 is that it has a perfect form factor for my use. Lastly, the NU43 is great for not just long walks outdoors, but it's great for in case of emergencies. You'll forget that you have it on. So how do I rank these headlamps? Number one for me is going to be the NU43 for its ergonomics for my personal use. A close second is the HC65 UHE, which is the most powerful of the three. And the UT27 is coming in at third. I really don't have much need for a warm light for my headlamp usage. I don't do long distance trail running as of yet, otherwise this would be my number one. So what do you think? Which headlamp suits your needs the best? Comment below and let us know. If you've made it to the end of the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll catch you guys on the next video.